hi guys welcome back to my channel so this is my smoky eye that I've created I hope you like it so just stay tuned to see how I do this So I'm gonna start as always by moisturizing my skin with this La Roche Posay. Next, the primer. This is the uh, Lancome, the uh, Pro Primer, La Basse. Next, I'm gonna correct as always with my NYX Correct uh, Palette with this pink shade here. And for the um, red spots on my face, I also used the uh, yellow corrector. So as my foundation, I'm gonna use this Misha BB cream. Um, it has a nice cover and uh, it contains a high SPF, 42. So be aware if you are going to be photographed in uh, flash, it's going to probably flash back. So about this much on the same sponge from the real techniques and pat it into the skin until you are happy with the coverage and the base looks flawless. For concealer I'm going with this bare minerals in the color fair and I'm applying this product under my eyes down the sides of my nose down the bridge of my nose in a straight line this will make my nose look straighter And a bit right here on the forehead. Blend all in with the same sponge. With the same NYX contour palette, I'm going to contour my cheekbones, make them sharp. make sure to blend the edges really well. Next, I always like to do this. I like to take a tissue, a clean tissue, and uh, just blot the skin quite softly. Just push it into the skin. So this will absorb all the extra foundation and extra oils that are sitting onto the skin. And next I'm gonna um, powder everything into place with this Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. Tap off the excess. So moving up to the eyebrows, I'm going to use this uh, NYX Frame and Tame in Blonde with a MAC 263. And I'm keeping the eyebrows quite soft just as I, I like them, just as I normally do. And to make them stay into place, I'm going to use this Maybelline uh, Brow Gel in Dark Blonde. So next onto the eye look, um, I want to do a smoky eye today and I'm going to start with using this um, Smashbox Call in Black. This is waterproof and um, it's quite sharp. I'm going to trace this along the upper lash line quite thickly and then 
smudge it with a brush, pencil brush. And as I go inwards, the line is going to be thinner and thinner until it fades away. I'm also doing a small flick with this. So going out, outwards and now smudge it. Because it is a waterproof um, pencil, it's going to be harder to blend out. But it's not important because we're going with different uh, type of colors. And now copy and paste it. So next I'm going to use these eyeshadows from Art Deco. Um, I'm planning to do a nice gradient towards the eyebrow and um, this is a lighter shade of brown, this is a darker shade of brown and this is even darker. So yep. Starting off with this darker shade, I'm going to um, apply it and press it with a shader kind of brush onto the um, eyeliner that I already have going. So with this color, I'm covering the entire mobile lid and also blend the edges. With the same black cone, I'm going into the lower waterline and uh, gonna smudge it afterwards, but it's going to look crazy at first, so bear with me. With the same call, I'm gonna do a bit of a tight lining. So with this middle kind of shade that I showed you um, at the beginning, I'm going to trace my crease with this Zoeva Soft Definer in number 227. So placing the brush into the crease and blending. Just let the brush do the work. And bring it out a tiny bit. Same here. So I'm going to intensify the blackness of the eye look in a bit, but I want to finish first the uh, crease. I'm going into the crease once more with a lighter kind of brown shade. I'm just going to blur out the edges of the um, second color that I've used, almost up to the eyebrow. So as I've said, I want to place this black from the Zoeva Nude Palette on top of the um, black coal that I already have going. So this is going to intensify that dark color that I already had. But be sure to keep the gradient that we are having. If you need to, you can go over that line and just blur out the edges once more. With the same middle brown and the same pencil uh, brush, we are going to smoke out the uh, lower lash line. I have a bit of a fallout with this eyeshadow, so I'm gonna go in with my um, concealer that I've used and just clean up. This will also sharpen that line there.
next mascara this is the l'oreal um, mega volume collagen in extra black top and bottom lashes so you can totally leave it like this if you are not comfortable uh, wearing false lashes but I'm going to and those are the Demi Wispies from the Ardell they are not too long not too thick so they go well with this kind of look while I let that lash glue dry I'm gonna use this NYX uh, powder blush in taupe to intensify a bit my contour so contour on flick I'm using another product from NYX, this time this is the blusher in Angel, only to the apples of my cheeks. I'm going back into that black eyeshadow from the palette and I'm going to use it just to hide the seam of the lashes. From Sleek, I have this liquid lipstick in Birthday Suit. And last but not least, this Maybelline tantalizing taupe is going only in the middle of my lip. So there you have it, this is my smoky eye. Um, I hope you like it. If you did, give me a thumbs up. I would love for you to subscribe if you are not already and follow me on social media to see more. So until next time, bye bye.